Hi, are you looking to offer your Zoho Creator app as a white label solution to your customers? This is where the concept of rebranding comes into play. Rebranding enables you to present your app under your own brand name to your customers with all the back-end operations powered by Zoho Creator. It allows you to maintain a consistent brand identity and instill confidence in your customers. Rebranding is available for both iOS and Android platforms. The screen you are currently viewing is the support desk app in Zoho Creator. The branding elements of Zoho Creator will be visible to the users. Rebranding provides you the opportunity to present your own brand identity for the application. Your users will not know that this app is being served from Zoho Creator. This video will provide you with an overview of the rebranding process in Zoho Creator. Check the links in the description for more videos related to rebranding. These steps are essential for rebranding your Zoho Creator app. You must perform these steps to publish your rebranded app to the App Store or Play Store. Prerequisites This step comprises of generating a set of files that are required to perform the code signing process. The steps in this process will differ depending on the platform where you intend to publish your application. Code signing Code signing is a process in which a software developer or distributor electronically signs the application file they are distributing to assure customers that the application will perform as claimed by its creator. This signature serves as evidence that the code has remained unchanged and has not been tampered with since its initial form. Code signing is mandatory for publishing your app in the App Store or Play Store. Next in line is the testing and submission step. You can thoroughly test the developed app and then proceed to submit it to both the App Store or Play Store. And voila, the app you created will be available in the respective store after the review. In the meantime, you might be wondering how your users or customers can access the rebranded app. Users have the option to access the app either through an invitation link or via their organization's mobile device management tool. On the other hand, customers can gain access to the app by either logging into the app's URL or by downloading and logging in through the rebranded mobile app on their mobile devices. So that's it. We have detailed videos covering all the topics we've discussed such as prerequisites and code signing. You may watch these videos to gain further insights. Subscribe to our YouTube channel to learn more about Zoho Creator and press the bell icon to get notified whenever a new video releases. Thanks for watching and we'll see you in the next video.